Hello there everyone and welcome to the start of a new campaign in Hearts of Iron 4 using the mod United UMC in which we're playing as the Empire of Japan. Which I think I left this on historical. I don't exactly remember, but I think it's on historical. And we'll see well, how well we do, especially as we try to beat up China. Um, maybe America. But you know what, like I said, we'll see how we do. But reinforce the traditional old ways. Because this is tri uh, historical. Oh, there's no description here. Create our own faction. Very cool. Level of the uncontrolled militarists will increase. Now, the historical option is to side with the Tosai Ha faction. So, the Tosai Ha, the control faction, is a political faction in the Imperial Japanese Army, active from the 1920s, formerly led by Major General Tetsuzen Nagata, along with Hideki Tojo. The Tosai Ha is a group of officers united primarily by their opposition to the Kohoda faction. Tosai Ha is strongly supportive for the Nanshin Ron strategy. So, this is a more historical version, and we're going to go with this one. Question is, I bought twos. If you completed with this one, we'll have the following effects more political power, stability, get empowered Zaibatsus, we lose even more political power and consumer goods. Wow. Well, that's kind of nuts. And we do this one um, exploit form training of IJA generals. Choose one of these four generals that was sent as an attache to either country. Huh. Inter unlocks inter service rivalry decisions. Uncontrolled militaries. And then after that one. Um, fall not following this path of Nan Shinron will. It has great penalties for, to our civilian war sport. Let me do this one. Add Nanshin Ron. Ooh, research speed goes down. Land doctrine research speed goes down, huh? Okay, factory output goes down too. We get more naval output. It's promoted by the Tosai Ha factions. Okay, so with the Kohoda faction. Well, it hurt us greatly. So. Mm, build upon the Tang Tangu Truce. Ooh. Marco Polo Bridge Incident. Just instantly go to war. Uh, let's see, naval, new uh, naval estimates, 35 to focus. Army expansion, liaison conference. The remilitarization of the Rhineland, of course. So it must be historical, like I said earlier. Liaison conference, develop a Zaibatsu home island landings. Yes. That's pretty good to get. So, and continue strengthening the Zaibatsu, so we need war. Uh, add total mobilization, wow. Daily political power gain. More weekly stability and weekly war support. That's not bad. But, uh, which one do we want to do? The liaison conference. Oh, Kohoda faction purged. Of the climax of the Aizawa trial to reduce tensions in the Tokyo area, the 1st Infantry Division was ordered from Tokyo to Manchuria instead. This caused the situation to escalate further, as the Kohoda faction decided that the time was right for the direct action and backed by the 1st Infantry Division in an attempt to coup d'etat. The failure of this February incident resulted in an almost complete purge of the Kohoda fact members from top army positions and resignation of Kohoda leader Sadao Araki. Sobeda ga fori mono ni no koru. Questions I bought these. Oh, no, okay, so this actually now gives us. Oh, we get controlled Zaibatsus. More political power, less consumer. Better consumer goods for us. Less stability, master impact goes down. It's not bad. Zaibatsus are financial clique. <clears throat> As an industrial and financial business conglomerate that controls significant parts of the Japanese economy. As ruled by the Big Four Sumitomo, Mitsu, Mitsui, Mitsubishi, and Yasuda Corporations. Yasuda. Oh, Yasuda Corporation. Oh, boy. So we're getting a of these treaties we really want to. Uh, government lobby, we want more, way more uh, stability, of course. Promises of peace. Um, right now, prospect resources, internal action decisions, interstate rivalry. Proclaim a total victory for Nanshin Ron. Oh. Hokushin Ron. Marco Polo Bridge Incident. And training with these guys. Imperial Conference. If not completed. Within. Oh. Uh, Imperial Conference goes in Kaigi. Literally, a conference between before the Emperor is an extra constitutional conference on foreign and internal matters of grave national importance as convened by the government of the Empire of Japan in the presence of the Emperor. It was a side distribution of national funds and approach to the armed branches of Japan. Well, let's be careful though, as planning or placating one could anger the other. <clears throat> so we need to complete this. Uh, let's complete in the last moment. Teleport if. How is national spirit dominant? So we do Fukoku. Fukoku, huh? That's good to get. Oh, so we just need Kukuku. Kyoi, right? Yeah. Well, I guess we'll do this one next, too. Enrich the country, strengthen the armed forces. That is our model, and that's what we always adhere to. Um, and here, um, military staff. Uh, we have this guy, but we can't have the same him as well as Hideki Tojo, so... I do want to get... Uh, let's see. This guy. This is the only guy that gives us daily army XP gain. I guess us division experience gain, too. We've got to give us slightly more... Political power, which is okay. This is not bad, too, for more um, attack defense. Even though we do take a little bit more attrition, but not more supply consumption. 
So, this is the guy. This is the, the guy that we really want here. But I want to grab Hideki Tojo if we can. So, level three, huh? Uncontrolled militarist. Well, even more attrition, which sucks. Um, yeah. Not great. Oh, wow. 250. I'm going to plus 0.25. Well, I'll use it probably for as long as we can. Add helps us with garrison support. So, we have a lot of stability. A lot of war support. Actually, I always forget this at the beginning. Can we send volunteers to you? Well, I don't... Can I just send air volunteers? I'll have a couple planes here and there. How many planes can we send, actually? Hundreds. Of, that's not bad. Fighters. We can send, like, this group here. Some both of you, actually. Just to get maybe some more air XP. We'll see. I'd love to go to work on you, but it actually hurts us quite a, quite badly. Turkey military is straight, so it's fine. Um, we can't really make too much, but I'll, I'm going to grab one more thing of oil. Uh, who do I want to grab it from? Empire of Manchuku. Oh, oh, that's actually really good to do then. Yeah. Oh, good God, yeah, we need that one. Uh, Malay would be nice. Uh, I'll oh, keep it like that for now. Definitely getting way more. Air XP now. Nice. Very good. So now, now we can do some of this stuff. <coughs> Excuse me. The Imperial War Conference that's going to be in the last six months. How do we do that one? Imperial War Conference. Well, abort. If not completed, when completed, Army Dominant Controlled to Service Rivalry. Strengthen the Army. We get two more military factions, which is actually pretty nice. Carriers. Oh, Institute Indiscriminate Conscription. Draft exemptions? No. Raiding regiments. Forces. Ooh. I like that. You get four more steel as well. Are we hurting for steel? No, we need rubber and aluminum, but what else is new? And are the militarists. We decrease. Oh, liaison conference over here. Oh, that's not bad. Oh, that's pretty good for us, too. Oh, get another research slot. Um, let's get another research slot. The Showa Kenkyu Kai, or Showa Research Association, was established in October 1930 as an informal organization led by Ryonosuke Goto, with the original tenor reviewing and assessing issues with the Maiji Constitution. The Showa Kenkyu Kai was a strong proponent of pan Asianism and formed the theoretical basis for the great, Greater East Asia Co Prosperity Sphere. We could grab you. We could wait. Military leader cost. That's only military leader cost. Hand of the militarists. Further decrease the level of the militarists. Hmm. Interesting. Imperial Rural Assistance Association. <clears throat> hmm. Not bad. Oh, political advisor has to go down. National Defense State. Where's the National Defense State? Ah, it's over here. So we'd be at war. So we'd wait to go to war for that one. Liaison conference would be nice to do too. By sending liaison of all branches of government and other military to a central conference, we can greatly increase our decision making speed. Now, obviously, I'm not going to be playing this super, 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 super optimally, but we'll see. Uh, exploit foreign training of generals. Lots of commanders from the Dai Nippon Taikoku Riku Gan were sent as an attaché to the Western countries, mainly during the World War and after. They studied their military tactics and equipment, and gathered useful information that are for a great use at home. Oh, experience with mission in Germany. British. Ooh. French war doctrine. It's not bad, too. And then, Chinese way of war. That's probably the way we, the guy we want to go. Yeah. Cool. Do we have a war conference? War conference. Oh, control the inner service rivalry. Is that an event? If not, then we'll see. I definitely want to do the Liaison Conference. Yeah. You know what? Screw it. We can we already have 
damage garrisons anyways right now anyway, so. Let's go and do that one. Four, four, seven, it's not bad. Ban the naval treaties. We can cheat on them, maybe. That wouldn't be bad either. Yeah. Nice. Go four through slot finally. That's good. 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 Way more coordination, and then handle the militarists. Well, we could do that one. Why not? Treaty signed. Between fifty and seventy-five percent. We cheat on them. Why not? Limit the AI a little bit more right now. As, as you can tell, I'm not playing this super optimally. As, I said we're doing this historically, but we'll see, you know. We'll see. Go to that one, handle the militarist maybe, and then because we are what? Foreign training is not bad. Uncontrolled. Yeah. Levels level three or higher. Oh, we could wait to do this one. Decreased. This one first. Nunchen Ron Doctrine. The Southern Expansion Doctrine is a military and political doctrine of the Empire of Japan, which states that Southeast Asia and Pacific Islands are Japan's sphere of interest, and the potential value of the Japanese Empire for economic and territorial expansion in those areas was greater than elsewhere. Uncle Paul Bridge, we definitely don't want to do that one yet. Afkikan. Ah, oh, that sucks. <clears throat> Down Western Roads. We organize military advance in China. <coughs> oh, that's not bad. Even more weekly stability. Find a common way out. Ichigo Sakusen. Ah. Force them to surrender. March through Canada. It's not bad. You move fast enough. Um, Ooh, 7% more output. Retention, but when you get more base. Factory bomb vulnerability. Well, <laughs> we'll see about that. Good job, guys. Now keep training. Combine you all together. Yay. Dive bombers. We're going to just go with uh, probably flight, fighter director. Probably. Yeah. All right. It's convenient in the last six months. So what happens if we do this? When selected, strengthen the army. And if I screw this up, oh my bad. Ah. Not sure wrong. Expansion laws. Oh, we keep the army. Modern modernization, spiritual mobilization. Ooh, weekly war support does go up. That's pretty good to get to. At least a little bit. Uh, continental situation. Oh. Continental situation. Situation on the home islands is stable, but that does not apply to our holdings on the continent. Must strengthen the Kwantung army in Manchuria as well as Prince influence in Southern Mongolia. Let's this one for some. Develop Zabatu's home island holdings. Zabatu's our financial clique. I think I read this one. Is, uh, yeah, I read this one already. Yeah. Ruled by the Big Four to increase the Japanese industrialization, we must expand Zaibatsu's holdings on the home islands. Yes. Control Zaibatsu's even better. Oh, yes, please. So, we'll do uh, army expansion law, too. Our government must have, um, as one of its core tenets, the immediate drastic increase of our military forces. Zaibatsu's, or the financial clique, are largely family control of vertical monopolies consisting of a holding company on top of the wholly owned banking subsidiary providing finance in several industrial subsidiaries dominating specific sectors of a market, either solely or through a number of subsidiary companies. The big four, Zaibatsu of Sumitomo, Mitsui, Mitsubishi, and Yasuda are the most significant Zaibatsu groups. Sumitomo and Mitsui have roots in the Edo period, while Mitsubishi and Yasuda trace their origins of the Meiji Restoration. Throughout Meiji to Showa, the government employs the financial powers and expertise for various endeavors, including tax collection, military procurement, and foreign trade. Sumitomo Group was founded by the Masatomo Sumitomo around 1615, a former Buddhist monk. It was mainly copper that made the company famous. Mining of ores, mainly copper, steel, and silver, and synthetic branches are the main of the main activities of the Sumitomo till this day. Mitsui was, Group was founded by the Mitsui Takatoshi in 1673 as a branch of the large Gofukuya kimono shop in Nihonbashi, a district in the heart of Edo. This genesis of Mitsui's business history began in the Inpo era, which was a 
Nengo, meaning a prolonged well. There they were granted the permission for money exchanges, opening their first banks and expanding to the other branches like the production of cigars, mining, and more. Mitsubishi Group was established as a shipping firm by Yataro uh, Iwasaki in 1870. In 1873, its name was changed to Mitsubishi Shokai. It operated in shipbuilding branches as well as mining and oil branches that provided resources for the merchant fleet. In February 1921, the MICEMC in Nagoya invited British Sopwith camel designer Herbert Smith along with several other Sopwith engineers to assist in creating an aircraft manufacturing dis uh, division. Yasuda Zaibatsu was founded by the entrepreneur Yasuda Zenjiro from the Yasuda clan. Yasuda's focus on banking was narrowed by the merger of 11 Yasuda-controlled banks into the Yasuda Bank in 1913. Uh, the post-merger bank was by far the largest of all the Zaibatsu banks. Sumito and the mining and machine business. Get a, a couple more resources, not bad. Provide additional bonuses after some time. Mitsui and the synthetic industry branches. Honestly, because we all know Japan, they're like oil star but we probably want to go with that one Mitsubishi and the cars chemics and aircraft ooh it's a plane sims a city and Millie you see it in the financial research sectors um you get a lot of political power and you get some more political power for 90 days which I don't get me wrong I like but as, as much as I love political power probably not gonna go with that one I love uh, the synthetic refineries but we could use some aluminum um, one, two, three, four, five, six more steel. One, two, three, four more aluminum, which actually be perfect for us right now. Um, synthetic refineries. Uh, do we have any? We. Uh, it's kind of hard to tell right now. I want to build some more. It's not bad. I mean, you get a few things here and there. You get a little bit more army XP and whatnot. I'm really pulling towards synthetic refineries. Resources. Uh, let's take a look here. So before we make any rash decision. Resource-wise, we are hurting. But if we take out China, we should be okay in terms of at least a little bit of steel, a little bit of aluminum, as long as we can move fast enough here. Um, especially, we, oh man, there's a lot of resources here. We're going to strike here to get more steel, especially the southern area. Uh, I'm going to say probably uh, synthetic refineries, just because we could use the rubber right now as well. As well as oil. So my bad. And now we're expanding the textile industry because we get more cities. In 1920, the textile industry was the most important branch, and Japan was mainly known as the manufacturer of wool and silk products, fabrics, and fans, toys, and similar goods. Even now, even though other branches are on a rapid rise, the textile industry still remains as one of the most important. Which would be very good. And the national defense state, I mean, as much as I like that one, that's going to hurt our political power. Recruitable population factor. Consumer goods factories. Weekly stability and war support. Quite a bit. So basically, it goes up by 0.2 every week. Even though we right now we get 0.2... Actually, that'd be okay. We do some war sport every week. Bastion in Japan. Extreme war production. Oh, boy. Um, Korean colonization laws. Oh, we get some aluminum there, too. So let's do that one. National Defense State. Um, then we have to get there to do this one. Yeah. That's just part of it called the Taisei Yoko Sankai. The IRAA forming process. You lose a lot of stability, war sport, and political power. That would be bad, though. But, and who's this one? Shin Tai Sai. Daily Compliance. Oh. Oh, we can do this one, too. Yeah. So let's do this one, and let's do Greater East Asia Co Prosperities here. We can try that one out. Why not? Because right now, as you saw, we are in Spain. Yay, Spain. And we'll stop trading our ships for now, just so we can actually start bombing loading crap out of the Spaniards. Really focusing on a lot of air speed. I don't want to get a lot of casts. I love casts. Casts is it's just so much fun to have. A lot, a lot of artillery, which is nice too. Um, these guys are 24 combat, which is probably a little bit too big in my opinion, but you know, whatever. Um, do we have enough of this? No, we don't. There we go. Oh, here, just go in here. Help them out. Nice. Might as well get more political power that way too. Uh, anything else since we we're off screen? Not too much. I did grab this because we need to make, make way more guns and we'd get more soft attack too. Uh, we got this guy going. We got this guy going. Uh, what else? Not sure what else we need to get next. In here. No, those are all ships. We're working on the ships, so. I did send the motorized, which they are 24 combo with, which is not bad. As well as cavalry, which are okay. okay. Nice. Ooh, can't go here. Oh. Oh, do we have a bonus for this? Japanese General Staff. 
Tactical Bombers. I mean, that makes sense. I want Cass, though. I'm sorry. I, I'm a huge sucker for Cass. Oh, give me a... Can we actually get this one? Japanese General Staff. Imperial Sanctions. Yeah. Militarism. Civilian factory construction speed goes down. War sport goes up. Uh... We strengthen the army a little bit. Oh, actually we lose political power that way. Oh. Well, actually this guy gives plus 50% stability. Holy crap, I didn't realize that. Well, regardless. I still want to go. Close air support. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Not really, not really. Oh, they're doing force defense. That's good for army XP though. That's really good for army XP, I love it. We will cheat on the ships a little bit, and with that in mind, actually. Our carriers, heavy ship hulls, we have 45 army XP. Um, rapid fire guns, no. Dual purpose, medium batteries, light cruiser batteries. Fire controls, we have nothing there yet. Some actual screens here, ooh. These are twos. Um, torpedoes? Yeah, you know, let's throw some torpedoes on them. And there you go. Okay, make some of this when, you're, when we're done. All these ships, oh, well, we'll see what happens. Nice. Radio's good. Um, reinforce rate. What else can we do? It's 1936 right now. Specialized stuff. Defense breakthrough. Probably really use that later on. Um, military leader cost, not bad. Get more political power. For now. Right, focus. Oh, we can do this already. Oh, but we don't have to do that one yet. We probably should wait. <clears throat> for a year, popular support for the regime will go down. So I want to do... I want to do this one. I want to do new naval estimates. We could use more dockyards. Let's issue new estimates for the size of the increase to our navy, and thereby the dockyard facilities that will be required to bring about this increase. For two years, naval experience gain, output, refitting, not bad. So next, we're going to grab... As I said before, I mean, obviously we're not playing. I'm not playing a uh, super uh, extremely well. I'm playing the way I want to play. Not optimizing too much. This is kind of hmm, plain stuff. Ooh, natural designs. That's not bad. Land doctrine cost. Eh. Yeah, I just wish we could get more army XP or air XP or something like that. Because if not, there's no point to do that stuff yet. Over here, air XP, no naval XP, no, no. And then we just saw all this stuff, and these guys. Yeah, I don't get any extra daily XP. We get the Prince, though. Army expansion law. It's not bad. Take more losses. So let's come over here and grab who? Put up more political power? Or we get research. Ah, oh, grab the political power. We'll use them probably all game. Screw it, why not? And we have him. Experience is capped to 999. Nice. 1.76 is not bad. Oh, we're done with... We have to keep building more millies. We don't have enough military factories. My gosh, infrastructure here sucks. Well, do that then. There you go. A millie and a city. You have estimates, and they'll do armor expansion law. Yeah, government must have as one of its core tenets the immediate and drastic increase of military forces. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, anything else? For... That much? Go and do this one. We get even more weekly stability. Cool. And help out. See what you can do. We're missing guns, artillery. Oh, a lot of support equipment too. A lot of support equipment. You have estimates. Armor expansion law. And then we'll come back over here and do... Um, what was it? Preparing for the war. Yeah, over here. The Southern Invasion. Anti-Western Cooperation with Siam. That'd be cool. Expand military production sphere. Korean laws. Ooh, automotive stuff. It's not bad, too. 
There's a lot of good stuff here. There really is. I love this. I love how much detail the uh, the dads have put into this. Army XP. You know, we'll do this, but we're not going to do that yet. Update equipment is fine. Mechanical computing is good. And it's now 36 still. Radar stations. I love radar stations. We don't need them yet. Definitely want to get some Mountaineers, though. So we need some aluminum. Yes, we do. Green colonization laws. Korean Peninsula is under Japanese control since 1905. Even though Koreans do not agree with our domination, steps must be taken to integrate their territory into imperial holdings. Our only religion will be our Shintoism, and only teaching will be in Japanese. Nice. Do I really want a grand battle plan? Spear firepower is better, but... Oh, Homeland Defense. I'll go slightly struggle. Why not? Ah, situation is what? Well, prioritize army craft. Some planes, it's not bad. It's been, yeah. Uh, Intersurface rival, where are we at? The army has been strengthened right now. Now? Now. Let's go something with a navy. Land army training. Two random generals. Get an aviation expert. Draft exemptions. I do like uh, indiscriminate conscription. Here, we do this one. There you go. That's completed. Nice. Taking our sweet time with this one, which is fine, fine, fine. Ooh. Get more if you can. We're still doing quite a bit of damage, which is nice, 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 nice. Green colonization. Um, hold the western line there. Uh, kind of into situation. Right? Nigerian projects, central banking. Where was that one with the puppet stuff? Uh, we keep building up our industry, but still. Um, yeah. Reinforce the line. That'd be good to do eventually. Ooh, this one's good to get too. We rushed on this. We get another research slot. That's pretty nice. That's pretty darn nice. Oh, but you get this one too. Even less resistance, more compliance. More stability. Gain cores. After 1944. Bank of Chosun. Not bad. Um, oh, that doesn't mean to look here. There's that one. Got in a situation, yeah. Oh, yeah, border conflict. That's what you you probably say to sort of border conflict. Got in a situation. Why not? We'll do this one next. I was wondering where that was at, because it's already 1937, which is not good. We've got to move fast. anti counter pact. Germany proposes that we sign a pact to address the Comintern's goal of spreading communism worldwide through the use of subversion and violence. While signing this pact, we'll agree to share intelligence of the communist threat and act in close cooperation against this menace. No. Of course not. Why would we? Fighters. Carrier-based fighters. Uh, what do we have here? That's good. Anything else? Nope. All right, then. Um, anything here we really care about too much? Build stuff everything faster. Damage garrisons. Prince of Terror is probably the guy we really want to get. Let's be prepared. But industrial, re industrial. With you. Mountains. Yeah, mountains suck fighting him. Really sucks. Are we doing any damage here still? Oh yeah, it's around Madrid-ish. Yeah. Well, we'll do the best we can for now. Stop training over here. Some of these guys are really, 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 really weak. So stop training for now. Because I converted all these divisions earlier. So. Alright. Maturing project. Maybe spiritual mobilization. That's not bad. Weekly war sport does go up more. I want to do everything here. I'll be honest. I want to do everything. But we can't. Um, expand military production sphere. Fair maturing project. Empire Manchukuo. Oh, adds limited conscription for them, which would be nice. Um, why not? Our puppets are weak and would not stand a chance against our continent or four woods alone. For a start, we must conscript the population and equip it with obsolete equipment. We can start that one. That's fine. Ooh, border conflict. As long as China's shattered, we can use their Mongolian puppet in Mangukuo to provoke a small border clash against Chinese warlord in Shangxi. Even though troops can't be involved, as it would cause a worldwide problem, we can easily put the blame on Prince Dem Chub Chug the Ong Grub.
I want to build this one too. <clears throat> of course, we can go to war with whenever we want against the Chinese, but still. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm XP gain. Training time goes down. Prince? Is that worth doing? I don't know. Let's choose him. Because we can. Oh, the Soviet volunteers are out too. Yeah, that's why it's taking forever here. This is starting to collapse, which is nice. Well, never mind. They're having problems over there as well. Prepare for the Asian campaign. Um, I do want to do this one just in case. The Tonglu truce was a ceasefire assigned between the Republic of China and the Empire of Japan in Tonglu District, Tianjin, on May 31st, 1933. It formally ended the Japanese invasion of Manchuria, which had begun two years earlier. In the eyes of the Chinese, it was seen as a humiliating defeat. The right will make sure to remind them. Pretty much. There you go. Here, just hang out real quick. Hang out first. <clears throat> That'd be good. Completely surround them. War conflict. We have a lot of divisions. Hope these divisions can hold out. I might actually lower the combat width because I don't like how big they are. Because we'll need more divisions, if anything. Yeah. You know what? You might just want to reduce it to, like... It makes them weaker overall, but per division, it's not bad. And it'll save a little bit of equipment and manpower for each division. So. Ah, see? Because we're going to need a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of different armies. Real fighters, not bad. <clears throat> I'm going to position them like here just in case though if we need to throw them on the line good idea Ooh. oh you won nice good job guys uh, where do we want to go next maybe here another one Ooh, oh we're making marines too that's actually really good okay, come over here these guys are only 12 combo with oh, whatever nice prepare the southern invasion plan Let's go with Manchurian Project. Our pup state in Manchuria, established in 1931, possesses vast natural resources as well as living space. These, however, only have little use for us if the Republic can't manage its own domestic problems. Therefore, we will focus on increasing its stability and eventually preparing it to become part of the Empire. Pretty much. Good, good, good. good. 37, come here. It's a ministry. Prince of Terror. I would like that one a lot, actually. But what else we have here? Wow, more range. Way more range. Unfortunately, now we're all out of coffee. Hmm. Oh, extends the inscription hurts pretty badly. Yeah, more organization would be nice. Land Doctrine, we could go with Land Doctrine. Uh, escalate it. Remove it, start a border between these guys. Between South Chahar and Suiyan. Now is that it? Because we need no political power for that one, which is fine. Handle the militarist, print censorship. Care about that yet? You know what? Say just in case, because like I said, this is my first time ever doing this. So, weekly war sport does go up. I like that a lot. You know what? We could. We have three more slots open, anyways. It's much like this guy. Actually, we want to get this guy because he gets a thousand members. So we want him. Maybe Prince of Terror, and this guy. Maybe we'll see. I don't know. Construction speed goes up, which is okay. More production costs for screens is fine. Max range goes way up. That's actually really nice. But you know what? For now, it'll save us something here. Still only 100. Nice. Good to see that. Nutrient project. Booked in arsenal. Weekly stability, sure, why not? 
And maybe expand mail to production sphere, maybe? Depends I bought two stuff. This is definitely where we want to go. <coughs> Excuse me. Now, so with that in mind, get a little closer here. Or go here. Now, that's going to get us hopefully way more air XP. 41.33? Yes. Pretty good. And destroy that Soviet division, too. At least, hopefully. We failed it. Wait, why? We didn't fail it. Guarantee we didn't fail it, but you know what? The game's like, nope. Let's spam it to production. Full control canto. Three naval dockyards, ships, aircraft. Yeah. Taichi Kawa has a huge military concern producing guns and other equipment for the Imperial Army. To provide our army equipment, it needs. Uh, no. It needs. We must expand its production. Oh! Oh, we can't do this one and this one. Okay, my bad. Marco Polo Bridge incident. Oh, well, crap. That's not good. Build upon. It has not completed that focus. Well, my bad. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, well, I guess it's not historical anymore. <laughs> East high B. Does it matter? Find a common way out. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter too much. We don't get this one, which sucks. We don't get that one. Daily command power goes up. Mm. My bad. Well, I guess next time. There's more time to build up, and the, which unfortunately gives more, more time to build up too. Which sucks, but whatever. Um, my bad, but I guess I'm still learning this mod. We need some serious supply around here. Because as long as we have supply, we'll do okay. Infantry is very good to get. Motorized, need 37. My bad. Well, with that in mind, I guess we gotta go down here anyways eventually, so land doctrine. Spend the Western Railroad. My bad. <clears throat> Actually, the grand invasion plan of uh, Asia. Expand the uh, Hosaku Kenyuku Kai plan. Our policies towards the South Seas instead of a group to explore military and economic expansion strategies to the South, which also cooperated with the Ministry of Colonial Affairs, Takumu Shou, to emphasize the military role of Taiwan and Micronesia as a basis for further Southern expansion. Oh, we got some big guys here, huh? If we can have enough guys here, I'll put you all around here. Where, where are you guys at? Oh, you're over there. It's fine. You know what? I want you to hold. Go back home for now. Because supplies are going to be god awful. Um, keep them there for now. We're just missing a lot of guns, huh? Yeah. So this is just in case we're going to need to do that. Let's have some too. And construction speed. It's only 5%, but you know what? I'll take it more than anything else. Get this anyways. Good. Keep building, 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 building. And two divisions are there too. Go and tr finish training that too. It's fine. Um, yeah, I should have gotten a war. My bad. My bad. Weekly war support. Do we have any more weekly war support? No, we don't. So we have to grab you then. Because we want FK come. Uh, Fujiwara Kikan, named after the leader of Major Fujiwara Ishii. Iwachi is a military intelligence operation that will be established in the IGHQ. It's task will be to contact the Indian independence movement, the overseas Chinese and Malayan sultans, with the aim of encouraging friendship and cooperation with Japan. Cool. 
active bombers. Yeah, I definitely want some uh, medium bombers eventually too. I ship a lot of ships and war fighters. Not bad. Nice. Let's so grab that guy next. Not aggression pack. Strike in the southern resource area. Barely naval bases. Taiwan, this place. Um, it's not bad. Spiritual mobilization. Give more population would be nice. <clears throat> more weekly war sports. We yeah, I'll do this one too next too. Mm -hmm. And you go here. I'm gonna start making marines because we need to make sure we have, we can make them even bigger. Keep working on that too. Uh, they're balanced currently. Well, if we could balance for very long. Maybe the navy, maybe. Again. We'll get more population first. Raiding regiments. Those forces go up. Yeah, I'll do that one. Naval stuff. Yeah. Mitsui is about to development. Uh, let's see, so this part we already read before, but Mitsui Group was founded in 1673. We read this as well. As we choose to provide Mitsui Group additional funds for the work, their business activities have recently significantly developed their national synthetic uh, industry. That's satisfying. Welcome. Nice. Good more. That's awesome. Nice. Good. Let's go ahead and come over here and do this one. My bad for not being very historical. My bad. Oh, wow. Not looking very good for them, how is it? Nice. Hey, Soviet divisions, go bye bye. Very good. Go right on ahead. I should have activated the the, the one with China way earlier. <clears throat> Excuse me. I just plan on them attacking us, attacking our lines a whole bunch. Begin, but whatever. Oh, we actually got it done. Nice. That's actually very good. Uh, how many air bases do we have? One. Good one over here. We'll need one at least. This is going to ram into our lines a whole bunch, so. And then we're going to grab this guy. Next. Good. Uh, okay, naval bases, strike, and Ah, uh, uh, oh, expand military research sector. Battles are won by spirit of the man, but also by the equipment. Our war ministers agree on that, and therefore we'll invest in a military research facility in Nagasaki. Yeah. Go buy five more and get more here. We're just going to need them. Way more trucks, too. Construction two. Rubber is going to be very useful. Grab some of that too. Medium manipulation is always nice. Uh, consumer goods this is better to do probably. Refined war bonds. Daily compliance is not bad too though. Uh, Thirty-seven though. And nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. We could use some support. Uh, more logistics, but we can wait for that probably. Radar is not bad. Thirty-eight. Go and grab this one. Reinforce frame whatnot. Research. What's down here? Don't think refineries into war stuff. Oh, I'll grab some basic uniforms. We have no basic uniforms right now, too. Wow. That sucks. Of course, we could use our puppet divisions to uphold the line, too. So that'd be nice. Alright, because this guy gives a thousand weekly manpower. That's very strong. More compliance and another operative slot. That's very strong. And actually, my bad with the whole China thing, like I said. Um, how, how long do you have this? So, inflation. Shadow of the Tongo Truce. Oh, so we're gonna wait till April next year. God dang it, my bad. It's completely my fault. But it was give us some valuable time. Prepare for the oil shortage. Oh yes. One thing our nation lacks is oil, therefore we must fill our stock for any war we might wage in the future. Yeah. Also, with this campaign, I do want to see how the AI, German AI, reacts. 
So I just definitely want to see how well they can do. So. Seven. Because we'll definitely use that too. And we get some oh, radar. I'm going to train what you need for now. As well as planes. So we do have a little bit of fuel. We got a lot of carrier stuff. It's good for the future. Critical actions close out of that one for now. Complete going up weekly war sports is good. Reinforced defense, it's fine. Throw you over here too. P5, do that. We need Yugoslavia, it's fine, whatever. Oh, darn it. Now, that's all gone. All sucks. It's been looked in Arsenal. What is this? Enforce the quantum leadership. Force the entry border. Spiritual mobilization. Bushido. Oh, well, that's not bad. That's pretty good, too. Spiritual mobilization, why not? By cultivating these tenets of Shinto that play on the people's sense of military duty, we can increase the amount of new recruits. And are we military dominant? Or army dominant? Or military dominant? Navy strengthened. Yep. You guys did a great job. Oh, you're all veterans. It's actually really nice. Oh, level 7 attack, too. Pretty good. Gun-wise, we're doing okay. We're going to need a lot of guns for the future, though. This is the year we're going to definitely go to war this time. My bad for earlier. Uh, oh, it has to be 7 or higher. Oh, crap. Kamikaze airstrikes. Increase uh, automotive stuff. Japanese automotive production is only 10% compared to the American one. That almost changed if we ever imagine good for full war, full war scale, full war scale with American giant. Hmm. Entrance of Austria. Gonna hang out there for now. Um, I will put a port here just in case. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe not. We're okay for now. Basic uniforms are nice. Go over your speed. Five research out. Very nice. Very, very, very good. Anything else here? Prospect for resources? No. Actions, naval treaties, propaganda efforts. Garrisons. I mean, that's going to be pretty strong to do, in all honesty. Let's go down here. Just automotive defense, yes. Eight. More coordination. Why not? I, don't, I just don't know which one we want down here. Not core manpower. That's not bad. Way more attack and defense. Prince of Jerry's gonna be really good though. You don't have to get this guy. I'll grab you, why not? Anyways. I'll start with this too. Yeah, it's gonna hurt us a little bit, but that's fine. Guns are good, trucks are bad, support guns are bad, trains are fine, light tanks we have a little bit of. Uh, what's this? Eight, grab some infantry stuff. That'd be good. Show sure, us steelworks. Ooh. Full economic integration. Resources, 38. Grab this other one, too, because we will be going to war this year. Hopefully we can hold the line, do well. Close out of you. All right, you guys go there. You guys go right there. The horrors will come over here. Because these guys are ready to invade. You guys are really good. Um, balanced, eh? I wonder if we actually hold along with only two divisions here. Um, not bad. Good. Close air support. Go with you. Automotive industry. National victory in the Spanish Civil War. For the Southern Invasion Plan. Would probably be good to do. Where do I get down here, though? Hmm. Central Bank of them. No, we'll do it anyways. Our invasion of China must be planned perfectly. Our army, air force, and navy will co coordinate the attacks in one huge blow. And the crush of Chinese defenses in a matter of months. All that will be directed by the Gunji Sanjin. Supreme War Council. That's production costs. Nice. 
Oh, three military factors, yeah. Aichi Koku Ki. Now, I don't know how fast we can do this, but uh, the goal is to move as pretty fast as possible as when we get this war starts, so. Next up, we gotta get some radar. We have to get radar. Build up. Keep building up the, the roads here, too. Any other ships? Look at you, nice. Level 5. Nice. Full plan attack is not bad, too. Yeah, this one. I'll experiment with things off screen, too. So, And as you can see, we do have. Uh, we're ready for naval invasion. Natural order. Do that one. That'd be nice. You go right there. I'm going to use you as a. Actually, you know what? You all. Come here. I'm going to use you immediately, anyways, probably. Just hold the line. That's all I care about. Hold the line. That's all that matters to me. As long as you can hold the line, that's all I care about. I'll wait for that one too. Um, I, like I did, I did say I want cast. I, I want as much dive bombing as possible. So we're gonna go with that one. We can wait for that one and cast. And we're bombers. There you go. Cast. We don't have enough yet, but we'll make some really good casts. Oh, we get radar. Nice. Good. Level one only. Whatever. Cast. Carry base support. It's only a couple years ahead of time. That's all. Just a couple year ahead. A couple of years ahead of time. Uh, naval stuff. Really focus on the army first. I get level 2, why not? I'm gonna wait for that. Airbase around here, it's good. Um, in the meantime, we have a couple of these planes here. Go boom, boom, boom. Fighters, 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 close air support, tactical bombers. So, one, two. Since you'll be hitting hit the most, probably, fighters and tactical bombers, go right here. Got more planes as well. Fighters, close air support. We will need you. Honestly, you can probably take some guys too if you really want. Duplicate these guys. More fighters. Go right there, because you will need them. Show us Steelworks. Liao Tung? Is that Liao Tung this one? Dalian. No. Ah, we're going to help our ally out maybe a little bit too. Sachi. Yeah, I'll go that one right now. And five. Apologies, we're not in too many wars right now. I'll get, grab this one. Fuel, oil gain, yeah. Army XP, yeah. Heck yeah. Good. And resource, better resource prospecting technology. That's not bad. Tanks, mechanized stuff. Three more dockyards, yeah. That'd be pretty good. Um, deal with them. Prepare naval bases. Yeah, that'd be good to do as well. Get a naval dockyard too. Oh, execute the ground plan. My bad. Yeah, we have to do that one next. Save just in case. <laughs> well, I'm also in Spies of China, too. Uh, balanced. I like being balanced. But we need more manpower. So you guys online right there. Ooh, radar. Be nice. And supplies? Not god-awful. Once we get Beijing, though, that definitely helps out a little bit more. Artillery-wise, we're doing okay. That's a little bit ahead of time. Can't quite do that one, which is okay-ish. Um, consumer goods, yeah. Oh, 1918. Free repair? Yeah, why not? I love using penal colonies. Attack and defense. You know what? It's more attrition, but whatever. I'm gonna grab you anyways. Puppet war goal? Well, I don't know if we're actually gonna puppet them or not. And since we're here, go and grab this one. It's fine. Off now. Oh, formal cavalry divisions. That'd be really good to do. So now we can go to war. My bad, we're not going to war any earlier. But this one's really good to get to. Let's do that. And since we're here, you guys go ahead and start uh, going there. And if anything, merge. I'll split you into four groups. Type 80 is nice. Artillery, nice. And if this doesn't go well, then it doesn't go well. You know, you know how it is. You find anything, you sink them. We'll do this for a little while. Sink whatever they have in the, in the ocean. So, And you go right there. You guys go right there. See if you can hold. That's a lot of divisions. I kind of doubt we'll be able to hold there. But whatever. And yeah. Let's save one more time. My apologies. <clears throat> can we go to war? 
They immediately attack us. Our allies immediately start attacking them too. Oh, no more economic growth. Well, that sucks. Can we hold? Italy bans the naval treaty owner, but that was good ahead. They're gonna be attacking us like crazy. Which is exactly what I want. Anything here yet? Nope. And ooh, that ooh. wouldn't be bad too. More millies. Always more millies. That's gonna look quite a bit better though. Um anything else here? Oh, throw conference. Ah. Yeah, that's right, we got that one done. Uh, since we're at war, we can go to there anyways. Grand battle plan. Uh, that seems okay. Air stuff. Sword efficiency would be really good to do, but we're not really don't need to be concerned about that too much. So we'll see what happens. National defense state. Yeah. For because right now we get plus point three, which is not bad. Plus point two. We can do national defense state next. Every citizen must be made to see the urgency of transforming our nation into a bastion capable of withstanding any assault. Pretty much. Extreme war production is not bad, but we can wait on that one. Central Bank of Manchu Quo. Manchuo. Manchuao. Manchuao. Probably not aggression back to the Soviets. Probably a good idea. Our northern border must be secured if we're to have the freedom to strike south. We shall begin negotiations with, negotiations with the Soviet Union immediately. Oh, look at this. Oh, yes. This is why we wanted to see use our actual navy here. Ah. Good. 38, like I said. Get some of that, too. Sink everything they got, and then we'll not retire navy, but, like, have them do something else. You are doing okay, right? And now, let's go and launch a naval invasion down here. If we can. That's the way they start attacking us and hurting us if they possibly can. Uh, let's see. Ooh, yes. Good. Ah, oh, the Chinese are down there, eh? Cut them out. And we'll see another army down here, too. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Take the goddamn base. Because we'll invade a lot more, too. So. Force it. Good. Prepare the neighbor bases and get the non aggression back going. Come on. I just want to take the thing, god dang it. Are they attacking up here? Uh, they're attacking over here, which is not bad. Over here, though. Hmm. Might be another story. Get Beijing. Oh, they're, they're crumbling. Oh, that's nice. Let's take a look here. What's going on? So, grand popular support. They have nine power treaty. They have inefficient bureaucracy. Good. Incompetent officers, which is good. Military affairs commission. Chinese unity. Sound of German cooperation for now. Uh, nothing really here. Ooh, army corruption. I like that one. And we'll need another army down here. You guys are over there, which is fine. You guys are over here, which is fine. You guys are down here, we're ready to go. Yeah, once we have... Okay, now with the new guys, it's good. You guys do this. What do you have down here? Infabious landing. Ooh, more defense. Evasion defense. Yeah, that's not bad. Naval liaison. Now, I'm going to send you guys down here. And we'll invade up here as well. And actually, if anything, I'm probably going to put you guys here. Actually, you know what? No. Half of you guys go here. Have the Marines come back. Send the rest of you guys over here. Even though you're a cavalry leader, I think I could be wrong about that. Cav. Frank Cav. Actually, I've never touched that before. Cavalry. Experience leader cost. God dang it, you PC doo doo. There you go. Uh, actually, this one. Let the prince do it. There you go. That's all for now. Well, and we'll be okay. And we'll do a lot of this off screen as I'll be trying to be gunning down a lot of Chinese people. Anyways, um, early cruiser hulls, they're not very good. We'll, we'll get them done first. So, uh, a couple more focuses. Non aggression pact, prepare the naval bases, of course, expand the Mangokuan arm, cavalry army. Our puppet regime established in Chahar and Outer Mongolia has only a little use for us. And we can't defend it by itself. Luckily, local people have long lived tradition in a warfare led for the horse saddle, which we'll use, utilize for best effort. Our use. After all, trucks can't sneak into mountains on the south. Probably. So we'll do that one. We'll do that one for the naval bases, like I said. Um, it's not bad to do. Anti-Western cooperation with Siam. That'd be really great. Uh, what else? Reinforce the Manchu border. Bank of, Central Bank of Manchuo. Uh, probably better resource prospect processing technology as well. Um, 
It's not bad too. It expands Zaibatu's influence in Korea. As Korean territory is being slowly integrated into Imperial domain, Zaibatu's also seek to expand its influence on Korean Peninsula. It also help with the integration and industrialization, but it also strengthens Zaibatu's overall power. And uh, that seems okay. We don't really need to do that one yet. Yeah, I'm sure it still works. It'd be nice too. But hey, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow as we'll continue with this campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great, 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 great Japanese rest of your day.